Hey guys, Tech Material with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're gonna be doing the unboxing of the iPhone 12 mini. This is gonna be the green model. So Apple Store does sell this model. If you're still trying to get it, you can actually get it right now from their website directly. This is a 256 gig model. And although there is a 13 mini, not sure why Apple has a 13 mini or even the mini series. This is the first time Apple actually introduced this size model, which is a 5.4 all screen display on the smaller side of phone. So if you have a smaller hand, it makes sense. We also did the unboxing for the, I believe the blue or the black one, which we'll leave a link in the description section if you guys want to check that video out. So you can get this phone right now off, like I said, on Apple's website, or you can get it from a carrier depending on wherever you want to get it from. So let's go take off the plastic first. So here's going to be the box of the phone here. It's a pretty small phone. The green one, like the other one, it does come in multiple colors, the mini ones. So you can actually get it in several other colors like product red, blue, black, and I think green is this special color here. So there's a wide range of color for these. That's kind of what the unique design about these are is that the unique colors that they come in. So as you can see here, the packaging wise, starting with the iPhone 12, as we mentioned and showed you guys in other videos, the only thing you really do get is that USB-C cable. You no longer get the block or the headphones for it and you don't even get the AirPods. So if you're thinking that you're gonna get a pair of AirPods or something, that's wishful thinking, but that is not Apple for you. So as you see here, this is the mini one. Again, comparing to the hand, it is really, when it talk about mini it is really a small device here in our hand so it's a 5.4 inch display and a couple other things in that besides the USB-C cable which you do need the either a 18 or 20 watt adapter so the 5 watt adapter no longer works on this and then you have the sim tray and then the pamphlet and stuff which is typical now but that's the standard stuff so we'll put that aside and actually get to the unboxing of the video here. So as you'll notice here now, Apple has these, uh, before it used to be like the plastic one, now they have a paper one. So you're gonna go ahead and peel that off and then go ahead and power on the device. Again, the power one should be pretty straightforward here. Like with any other iPhones, this phone again, are gonna come out just like any other phone setup. So we're gonna go ahead and set it up. The iPhone, this model actually cost a little bit more compared to some of the other base model. Remember this one comes in 64 gig and you can also get 128 gig and the 256 gig, which is the model we have. So the most storage you can get on a mini is the 256 gig, which not sure why Apple didn't include the 512 gig, but that's most you can get in terms of storage. So like any basic setup here, we're gonna go ahead and put in our Wi-Fi info for the demo Wi-Fi that we have set up. So we're gonna put the password in and get it set up to, to the home screen. So here, you'll notice here, comparing to what we'll do a comparison with the 12 mini, that big top notch is noticeable. Although this is the all screen display, it gives you about almost close to 86% screen to body ratio, which again is, humongous um, in terms of the body ratio itself. The other thing you'll notice for the US model especially is that that 5G and MMM wave antenna, this might not be available if you're an international uh, model that you have. So the Apple does produce different models. That's one thing to note. I know something you guys asked here. As you can see here, the, the green color here is a light green. It's not a heavy dark green like these plants that you have. As you can see, these are much darker. So if you're expecting it to be like a darker green, it's not a darker green, it is a light green. You do still get that 212 megapixel camera. So when you're setting it up, as you can see here right now, it's going through the setup process for it. The resolution on this phone is a 2340 by 1080 pixel, uh, and it does come with the 60 Hertz refresh rate, unlike the iPhone 13 Pro and the 13 Pro Max, which have that 120 hertz refresh rate. You're still getting that only 60 hertz of refresh rate. So that's one thing to mention. But the other unique part about the 12 mini is that you do 
to have that 4 gigs of RAM and that A14 Bionic chip. The A14 Bionic chip is a powerful chip by no means. It's, it's just a, even though this phone might look like a miniature phone of the regular 12 and the 12 Pros, this does come with quite the power in terms of the hardware. It's not that Apple put anything light in terms of their chip. So they are using the same exact chip for their premium models. So as you can see, all of this stuff, we went and talked to you guys in another video and doing the setup here. So all we're doing is simply going through and selecting pretty much skip and skip until we get to this main screen. And we're in the main screen here. We're ready to go. It's ready to launch. If you haven't had the chance to put your SIM card in, this is where the SIM card gets on the left hand side. There's a pin here, the SIM ejector tool from the packet. You can pop it in there, put your new put your SIM from your existing phone or if you got a new SIM which we recommend use that in new SIM again. So that's kind of where the mini lies. It's sort of small in your hand if you're used to a bigger phone but nonetheless it is a decent sized phone for even if you have smaller hands it's not something to compare to. We're going to do some comparison so you guys can see the actual size difference here. The interesting thing about the 12 mini is that you can upgrade it to iOS 15 because of course it was released November of 2020 so it's been just a little over a year since it's been released and this phone if you have it right now you know that the phone again the one downside of this phone is that battery size because it is a smaller phone it does only have a 22 27 mAh battery and paying for this phone which is a 256 gig you're paying going to be paying close to just under uh 750 dollars depending on where you get it from maybe tax you can even look to pay up to 800 for this 256 gig model so this phone can be expensive and apple still sells it it might be a better choice if you're thinking of buying a mini going with the 13 mini just because it is out there and you can purchase either of these devices you're only it's this phone is only what a, i believe it's like hundred dollars cheaper so it doesn't really make sense if you're really looking to purchase a phone like the mini probably the 13 mini although these phones never picked up the way that apple would like to have in the market they are still decent devices just that small size battery probably is what's uh, the downfall of the mini size phone is. So we want to hear from you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this unboxing video. What your thoughts are. If you guys have used the mini or if you're purchasing a mini and any sort of experience, leave a comment in the comment section. Thanks for watching guys. See you guys uh, next time.